they have package. Okay, so today is one of those weird little purchases that I don't do very often. And this one's coming all the way out from Timu. Pretty crappy packaging, I'm not going to lie. But let's jump into it. So this package I ordered off of Timu is supposed to be my earbuds or well in this case it's supposed to be my bluetooth microphone so i can start filming a little bit better with my channels nothing good in there bad actually i mean the packaging's already messed up on the side so if i wanted to keep it i can't it's supposed to be completely wireless bluetooth yep seed to seed type instead of iphone Supposed to be two instead of one. It did say something about it being water resistant, but let's just get past all that and just get into it. All right, so right off the back, we got plug and play, 20 meters of accessible reception. I don't see anything on waterproof, so, I mean, I wish I could say they lied, but at the same time, I wasn't expecting it to be waterproof. Right off the jump, though, got a pretty case, looking pretty dirty. I mean, I don't know if y'all can see that very well or not. I'm going to give you a little bit better light. Looking a little dirty, not too bad. Case looks pretty good otherwise, I mean... Really good condition. Obviously, you get your instruction manual. Who cares about that? Cute little foam to hold it in. Standard little packaging setup, and this should be my C2C type. Let's see how that works out, huh? Yeah, that's uh, pretty small. <laughs> Not like we need a whole long of a C to C type, but could have been a little bit longer. Now to get to the fancy package. Not bad. Got a little bit of a wobble, probably because it's that little oval design, like a pill. It's misbalanced because of the C type in the back, but I mean, all in all. Got a really nice close. Not only that. Ah. Case already came pre-charged. Not bad. Got some good charge on her. Well, give me a second. We'll put you guys on the microphones. See how they actually sound real quick. All right. So we got it already connected into the phone. Can't hear it yet. Y'all should be able to hear it better than I can. I should be able to hear it last minute. It claims that it's got some sound canceling, so it should be able to basically mute sound around me for the most part. So we'll give it a shot by clicking it into the good old fashioned shirt right here. And I mean, not bad, pretty lightweight actually. Case is really, really, really nice. I mean, not bad. <laughs> I really kind of like the clothes on the case there. And on top of the case, though, I mean, we got basically two and then the transmitter, which transmitter doesn't need to be plugged in, but the pieces need to be plugged in. And they do not have a C to C type option at the bottom in case the case dies. So, I mean, really no need for it, but if you're ever worried about your case dying, they don't really have much for a port, which is still fine. I mean, you think they'd be a little bit waterproof or something, like IP6 or something like that, IP9, IPX9 or whatever. Not bad. Let's see how the audio sounds right now. I'm not going to lie. So... If I had to rate the cost, so the price of this was only like $23, which between you and me isn't really that much. So, you know, you, you get what you pay for on them. But 
I mean, the audio is kind of crappy, but also kind of there. So it means like if I wanted to like speak up, I could. Or if I wanted to speak lower and probably talk a little bit more toned and quiet, I guess I could and it won't do much for me. But um, I mean, it's not bad. Probably sounds better on the hat than it honestly did rubbing up against the clothing all the time. So honestly, I think it's a... Timu definitely got a win on this one. I got some more Timu products that are coming that I'll play around with for y'all so that way you can, you know, see if they're worth it. Even though in all reality, their products are still worth it, even if you're just trying to save a buck or two. Would I recommend this? I'd give it about a... 5 out of 10, so that's about halfway. And the only reason I'd say that is, I mean, it's got a little too much echo, a little too much static. Uh, I feel if I'm recording on a day-to-day -day basis with this, that the audio is going to need to be cleaned up before it can be uploaded. Can't really judge much past it, though, other than that. I mean, it's going to do, hopefully, what I need it to do. <laughs> and that's just so that way I can run my vape recycling business and then show you guys content in the process of it. Speaking of which, got another video coming up soon, which will have way more stuff. I'm going to have a bunch of vapes being torn apart soon. Got about 22 to tear apart this week on top of a bunch of THC ones. So if y'all feel like sticking around and seeing some content, don't be afraid to like, follow, and subscribe.